This is Simon Fraser University Discovery Park, a place I went to university just in 1998. I graduated. This is a particular uh, place where people live and study and we are going to take a look around this nice mountain campus to see what it looks like today. This is Avienda, a new potential student for Simon Fraser University in about, oh, 18 years? No, in about 16 years. And she has something to say. Okay, maybe she doesn't have anything to say, but she's very cute and she's at this place for the first time ever with mommy and daddy and our four-month-old baby girl, Eve. Okay, so where should we go? Abby, can you have your water first, Abby? Abby! Bye-bye, Abby! Don't let her play in the meeting. So this is the new Simon Fraser University, a place where I used to go, but now it's been redone. This is new. I've never seen this place before, 10 years ago. If we look at the entrance, this is where students are now living and studying. It's a multi-tenant facility, a new one. And let's go have a look inside, shall we? So we already see that Avi and Mummy are inside. And then looking inside, it's very clean, very new. There are a lot, it's snuggled in between the trees. Radiation safety. So that is SFU, part of SFU over there in the distance. And this is a trail that is all around SFU. Where the university is on the top of the hill or the mountain. It's Burnaby Mountain. Well, it's not really a mountain, it's like a big hill. And then all around are all these trails that the students and anyone visiting can go on. And it feels like a park. It's the most amazing place to have a university at the, basically the top of a natural, no civilization, nothing up here except the university and dorm rooms and a few shops for eating, but it's mostly just nature with a little bit of concrete. So here we are at SFU. This is where I used to go and they've built all these new uh, places, residents for students to live in. And all of this feels uh, new because 12 years ago when I went here, uh, or was it 13, 13 years ago now, um, it was just mostly concrete. Now it's a really nice mix of color and construction, architecture. Um, I'm impressed. Hmm. None of this looks familiar to me. Yeah, they all new. Diamond Alumni Center. I remember going to that one. So, so this is the old university. This is one of the original buildings. It's called the Quadrangle because there's like, you know, quad four areas. It's like a square. So have you been there? It's a really boring building. It's just one big box. And did you go there? Yeah, we had a lot of classes there. Oh, oh this is a three-way. Oh, what sorry. do you mean three-way? It's a stop sign. So that's oh. yeah, the oldest part of the university. And this is more classrooms. Mm. Not that impressive, actually. 